Ba-da, 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 da 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 Set up the streams. Oh, yeah, set up the streams. It's G from the Academy with an update. And the update goes like this. I just had a consultation session with a potential client. And... I like this. I like this client because uh, he was uh, thinking carefully about his future. He was thinking carefully about what he wanted, and the client contacted a at least at least one other person who could help them. At least one other tutor, and I thought it was interesting comparing the different approaches of different teachers and different tutors when when helping people and if you are going to employ a tutor if you are going to employ a coach if you're going to get someone to help you with your life then here's something that I want you to think about and I want you to think about this really really carefully really carefully because uh, let's take the example of, say, tutoring for languages. Let's take the example of the English language. How, un- how unusual. Yes, I know. Let's take the example of the English language, right? And uh, let's say that you're looking for a teacher or a course and that you're in a consultation session. I want you to think about what is fitting into what? What is fitting into what? Now, what does that mean? That means, is the teacher or tutor trying to fit you into their program? Is the teacher or tutor trying to trying to squeeze you into their little box? Or is the teacher or tutor trying to fit the skill, in this case the English language, into your life? Is the teacher and the tutor prepared to take the time to sit down with you and to find out what you like, what you're interested in, what your habits are, how much free time you have, how your work works, how your life works, and find a way to put the skill, in this case language, into your life, because this is what this school does. This is my approach. My approach is to listen to what you need. Listen to the habits that you have, the interests that you have, not just where you work and how you work, but how you spend your free time. And then to find a way of fitting the English language into your life so it becomes part of your lifestyle, so it becomes part of your daily habits so that you can work with it in what will be hopefully a stressless way. We need some stress, we need some pressure applied for progress, but if we do it in an intelligent way, we can make the whole learning process much easier. We can make the whole learning process much easier. So when you're looking for a course or a tutor, think about are the organizers of the the course trying to fit you into their box or are they going to take their skill and try to find a way of incorporating their skill into your life and your lifestyle? Because that's the way that it should be. That's the way that it should be. They should be listening to you and trying to find a way that they can fit the skill into your life on a daily basis that fits in with with your ideas, your philosophies, and your plans. So think about that. Are you fitting into their box or are they fitting into your lifestyle? Trying to make sure that whatever you incorporate into your life, it fits in to your lifestyle. There you go. That's the point. If you want more information about what we're doing, there are lots of videos posted today. Check out the Facebook page and uh, check out our homepage for our courses, uh, www.nsa-slovakia.com, wherever you are. Have a great day.
speak to you soon. Enjoy the sunshine, if the sun is shining wherever you are.